Hello my dear friends, you are on the Military Summary channel. In this short video we are going to discuss the most important events that took place during the previous night of the local time. According to information we have, the Russians during the previous night they managed to discover and to destroy another Ukrainian artillery system with Lancet strike in the Kherson direction. And as you know, according to information we have, the Russians have already published more than 600 cases, 600 events, 600 strikes of Lancet against the Ukrainian artillery system. Now we are moving further to the Arekhov area. The Ukrainians continued their offensive operation and storming operation in the vicinity and the settlement of Yerbova. Currently there is no active there are no active clashes and active offensive attacks the only thing we have is like artillery preparation strikes and drone strikes and so on the Ukrainians continue redeployment of their forces in the fields and between the settlements of Robotina and Verbova and continue accumulation of their forces in Robotina itself with the next with the purpose to attack the Russian positions in Opera Kopovka and Kopany. Uh, today the uh, Russian the Western sources published very interesting uh, photo and video of the newly created the defense line that the Russians started building on the south of Verbova. So, from one side we see that the Ukrainians attack uh, in the, uh, on the Russian positions, but from another side we see that if the Russians lose the defense belt, they start building another one a few kilometers to the south, east or west from the positions they've lost. Furthermore, the Russians continue bombing and attacking the Ukrainian positions in the settlements like Malatakmachka and Arekhov. For example, on this video we see how the Russians managed to discover the concentration of Ukraine and forces and as a result of usage of guided bombs, the Russians managed to hit and destroy the Ukrainian positions. The level of losses of Ukrainian forces is unknown. Furthermore, the Russians managed to discover another Ukrainian command center machine. This is like operational machine uh, that Ukrainians use for officers. And from this uh, vehicle track, the Ukrainians can control and support their uh, troopers on the ground. So as you can see, another usage of Lancet deep inside of the Ukrainian defense belt. When talking about Vimevka tactical bridgehead in the south Donetsk, we haven't received nothing during the previous night. When talking about uh, Bakhmut Klishevka direction, the Ukrainians still can still storm the settlement by the name of Andreevka. They still control the Ukrainians still control their positions along the railways on the north and along the railways on the south. And today the Ukrainians published the video how they managed to discover and to attack the Russian infantry that were moving along the forest lines in the vicinity of Andreevka. The entire plateau was destroyed as a result of uh, Ukrainian artillery strike. As you can see, according to the geolocations, we see that the Russians launched another wave of massive counter-artillery duels. The Ukrainians lost another concentration of their forces, or uh, to be more precise, the parking lot of military equipment in Chasov Yar. As a result of another guided bomb usage, the Ukrainians lost the entire parking lot with a significant number of trucks that the Ukrainians were using to support and supply their forces on the ground. Let's take a look one more time in the moment of explosion. This one, you see this on the video, the guided bomb usage. Guided bomb is a very powerful weapon, as we can see. Furthermore, the Russians continue repelling and pushing the Ukrainians in the vicinity of Zelizhnyansk uh, after very fierce clashes and battles that took place, that been taking place uh, since the beginning of the 20th of August till, let's say, the beginning of September. The attack, that attack, those waves of attacks were repelled by the Russians and currently the Russians start bombing and shelling the positions and forest lines in the vicinity of this area with the purpose to force the to step back. In the vicinity of Zvanovka, the Russians discovered another Ukrainian position and as a result of strike with Krasnopel, the accurate shell, they managed to destroy another mm, checkpoint or the stronghold of Ukrainian forces in that settlement. And that's it for this short video. The military summary channel reminds we condemn any violence in the world. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Put your likes, join my Patreon and have a good day. Bye-bye.